to help you get down. But as you're going down, your suit compresses. So because of that, you can be you falling out. The, uh, right. So the more you go down, the more air you add to this just to keep you up. Oh, really? Yeah. To keep you buoyant at whatever level you want to be at. You know. And as you go up, you let air out of this. Because now your suit is filling back out again. How long can you go on one tank? Depends on the, on, on the depth. Whether it's 40 feet or 60 feet or 80 feet or 100 feet. That all depends. You can go up to an hour, depending on where you are. You know. We use that for everything. Well, this there is used for the buoyancy, which you don't use a lot. You want to use it a little bit as you're going down to fill that. And most of it's for breathing. Right. You know. So, yeah. And this, this has got a safety on it. If you ever overinflated it. releases the air. There's one down there that releases the air. That releases the air. And that's the computer. That keeps <coughs> a track of time air, down. Time, air, depth, everything. Everything. So. That's about it. That's about it. How long would you have to drop your tank off and pick it up to get refilled, or they do it right there? Uh... At the core, they do it right there. They do? Yeah. Shops will do it right there, but I usually drop it off and pick it up a week later. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you're saying we're going to build a skiff now, or we're going to have you as a diver getting our gold, or what? <laughs> 